Hi guys, so today we're gonna be making a review of this doll which is called Ginny. She looks a lot like Barbie and actually she's a Turkish doll. I don't know if you might have similar dolls wherever you live. I paid 38 liras and that's uh, about $15 and um, the total cost it's, it was really 35 liras. This is the pack of the design and then the actual doll herself and I'm going to be removing some of the ties that the doll came with on the back so that we can see everything. Now here we have the doll and the first thing that you can see is that it came with a lot a lot of items it came with this table which is very very nice on the bottom of it it has a little bit of um, it looks like little stars I don't know if you can see it it looks like glittery stars and it comes with a very nice top and a very nice base it comes with four chairs and I have my chairs here and you can see that they are very detailed on the back it says genie on the back of the chair and you can see that even there is a lot of detail at the bottom of the chair on this particular chair we had an extra gift which is a pet for her it's a pet cat and you can actually remove this pet by removing the plastic pan which i'm not going to do right now but i really love that and she also came with this lamp here that has different colors and we're going to put the base for the lamp it also has a lot of shimmer to it, a lot of glitter at the base of the lamp, in the lamp itself. So I am very excited to have this piece for my dollhouse. Here we have some of the items that the doll came with, some of the food. We have what seems to be two omelets, I'm not really sure what they are. And then we have two cheesecakes, and we have one here, and then we have the second one here. And we also have a teapot that's for tea time, I guess. And we have two containers. I guess these are sugar containers. I'm not sure. You can let me know in the comments below what you think these are. We have a teacup and a saucer. And we have the second teacup and saucer. And I don't know if you can see the detail from the side here it's pretty nice we have the cups for the doll and then we have a base that came with one flower it's very detailed it's very well made so I am very impressed by the quality of these items we have a pitcher for water and then we have a fork and a knife we have a set of four items here two forks, two knives, and then we have the doll herself. Now I'm pretty happy with this doll. I really like the weight of the doll. She's very heavy. The dress of the doll is very well made. I love the bow. I love the different colors. I love the shimmer in the actual fabric. The feet are articulated. She's pretty much like the brand new Barbie dolls that are out in the market. And so you can put heels on her. You can actually put flats on her. Her hands are articulated so they move, her head moves around as well. And also the middle section of her body moves because it has this type of joints. And this is a bargain. This is really a bargain because the cost is about $15 or less of US dollars, which means that with the cost of one regular Barbie, not even the super duper Barbies, you can actually get all the things that you see here and you can see that there is a lot. We have a lot of chairs, we have the table, we have the lamp, we have the pet, we have the food and all the things that came with her, plus the doll. I am really amazed at the cost. I don't know if you have this type of dolls where you live, but I would really love to hear from you. And let me know if you like this review and if you would like me to do more reviews like this with uh, Turkish dolls. Well, I hope that you enjoyed this video as always and I will see you on the next one. Bye!